Hey guys, Mike Perna with Keller Williams coming at you again with a brand new blog post, our top 10 cider mills in Metro Detroit. First, I want to give a big shout out and thanks to the couple hundred people that had responded to our survey, gave us some great feedback. Thank you for your input. And also thank you for your stories, your own personal family stories on these cider mills. So we've got the top 10 cider mills as voted on by you here in Metro Detroit. I mean, and these guys span all the way from, you know, deep Rochester, Armada, all the way down into uh, Ypsilanti. Some of them are some, are, uh, some of my personal favorites. Uh, two of them I've been going to since I was about four years old. One of them, I remember, and you, you guys might know this one, the Rouge River running by it, and of course, as a six-year-old, had tons of fun pushing my sister into the river. Awesome donuts, more fun for the big brothers pushing the sisters into the river. Um, other than that, we've got a couple of uh, newer additions to the list. Uh, one of them, and I'll name it right off the, right off the get, is uh, Blake's. Definitely a great one. You, 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 got, you guys got to get up there and try it. Not only is it great family fun, it includes, you know, the petting zoos and the apple picking and all the different things. But as of this year, they're now including zombie paintball. True story. So you get on a truck, you get given a paintball, a paintball gun, and zombies run around and you literally just shoot the zombies. That's how much fun it is. Great target practice, so it's both fun for the kids and fun for the, the adults. Um, some of them also include some pretty, like, uh, like I mentioned before, some pretty massive apple picking. You know, Irwin's is definitely one of our favorites with 847 different types of apples, or at least a dozen, but it feels like 847. And of course, Franklin Cider Mill, which is a fan favorite of mine. I've been going to since I was four or five years old. You know, two reasons for it. One, of course, fantastic cider, fantastic donuts, the big mill wheel. It is the quintessential. It is the thing that you think of when you think of cider mills. If you hadn't been, go. Also, right there in downtown Franklin, if you're a McKenzie Child person, and I'm not because I don't really like Tim Burton and it all looks like Tim Burton to me, um, there is a, the best than biggest McKenzie Child store in Michigan right there about two blocks away. Thank you again, guys. Please check out the blog post and also comment if you can at the bottom. Let me know what cider mills I'm missing. Let me know your favorite memories at the ones that we have. Let us know any... Um, you know anything else that we're missing next up and uh, next coming up is going to be our top 10 haunted houses in metro detroit please go ahead and throw some comments at the bottom of the blog post as well about your favorite haunted houses um that will be coming out before the end of the week so get excited about that yes we are totally in fall we're totally moving into the end of the uh the both the cider mill and the halloween season last things uh, last thing uh, before i let you go let me know what you guys are dressing up for for halloween and that's about all I've got. As always, if you're thinking about buying a home, if you're thinking about selling a home, or you're looking for a career in real estate, please don't hesitate to reach out to us anytime at 248-886-4450. Make it a great day.